Hello everyone, here with my P582 Unit 2 forum response um, to research problems in our vocation. Uh, this is to identify and describe a specific research problem that needs to be investigated in the field of physical education, coaching, administration, fitness, and athletic training. Um, the problem that I chose was the various stresses of coaching and athlete management are causing the burnout of coaches. Um, according to the text, the guidelines for choosing an appropriate problem, uh, one of the first points they made was to look to look around you. And I was having a hard time thinking of a, a, a problem that I could talk about, a research. Um, but when it suggested to look around you, I th was thinking about it. And uh, just a couple of days ago, I had a a buddy of mine that coaches at a local high school uh, was calling me to um, set up some preseason games because our season's coming up pretty soon. Um, and after talking to him, he said this is probably going to be his last season. Uh, I was asking him why. He said he was just burned out. It's just too much stress that uh, he didn't want to deal with anymore. He, wasn't, he was basically going to hang up and not coach uh, high school soccer anymore. And to think of it, uh, about a week ago, I called another buddy of mine that we usually play preseason games with, too. I called him to set up a game, and he said he's not coaching this year, that he was burned out. So he's just doing club, and he's not going to do high school anymore. Um, and then thinking thinking about other coaches, uh, we had a coach that coaches at the same high school that I'm at. Um, he quit last year. Uh, he was a basketball coach at our school, um, quick because he said he was burned out also. So um, some of the other guidelines that talked about was um, to read existing research. I looked up uh, on Google Scholar, like the text suggested, to look up some articles, and there was quite a few about coach burnout. And um, one of the other guidelines also said to choose a topic that's intriguing and that motivates you. Um, that's pretty intriguing to me because I've been feeling kind of burned out myself the last couple seasons. Um, uh, in 2015, about three seasons ago, uh, we actually had a great team. We ended up winning Division One Southern California State Championship in uh, Division One soccer high school. Um, we had a great season. I had a great group of kids and... Um, had a lot of fun doing it. Uh, the following season was basically the polar opposite. Um, I had a bunch of attitude problems. Most of my players left because they were seniors, but the guys that returned had a lot of attitudes and kind of uh, big-headed, uh, didn't want to listen, thought they knew everything, and just was a terrible season that I had to kick people off the team. And then last year was kind of a, kind of a rollover of, wasn't as many attitudes, but it was kind of uh, not a big difference from the year before. Uh, it was also a tough season. Ended up being my worst season ever coaching. Um, and it was highly stressful and just wasn't worth it the last couple of years. So hopefully this year's going to be a lot better. So I was kind of intrigued to find out because I don't want to quit coaching, but I am feeling a little bit. Um, burned out at this point, kind of looking for a change maybe, I don't know, we'll see. And then it also talked about the um, topic that others would find interesting, I believe people would, um, I know a lot of coaches feel that stress, of all the different stresses that we feel as coaches um, that come with the job, and then feeling burned out because of it, and a lot of us teach also at the same time, so those stresses come into play. Um, what else? And then being realistic about what you can accomplish with the, the research. I'm not positive how far I want to go with the research. If, if uh, This is only my second class. I haven't really decided on what my um, capstone and research project is going to be about. But... Um, Possibly this, 
we'll see. Um, I think that's about it. Thanks.